I discovered these blackhead tools made from Japan and of course your girl's gonna see if they actually work. They cost about 2 bucks or so and I got 3 extra to give away but just letting you know now they're kinda shabby looking, I didn't do it, it came like this. You can see that the middle contains a knob and on the sides it says cleaning. Right now it's locked but I'll show you how it works in a little bit. Also one end claims to go deeper than the other side. I almost wanted to use a file to file down the plastic pricks sticking out but okay whatever. First I wasn't sure how to use it so I was basically jabbing my face with this. Ouch! No blackhead was coming out let me tell you that. Anyways I wiggled it a bit so I spotted a blackhead and I did the same but was left with a little dot, a dot of regret. I decided to go back to my nose where my pores were the softest and surprisingly I actually got things out. It looks like I almost broke my nose though. <sighs> You can finally see the residue it draws out, sebaceous filaments, come to mama. It did hurt a bit, but it was more uncomfortable than painful. But seriously, I could have broke my nose. I mean, seriously, look. Just kidding. Anyway, here's a side shot so you can see how gunky things got. And guess what? I was doing it wrong. It turns out you're supposed to be swaying it left and right. Faye, you earhead. Now, remember that stubborn blockhead? With the sway method, it actually worked. And like I mentioned, when you want to dispose the funking no trunk, you swipe the tab to the sides, and when you're done, just slack it in the middle. All in all, I think no strips work so much better, but for a dollar or two, this is actually cool. And it works to a certain extent. So if you do want to try these, I don't blame you if you don't. Just comment below with your Instagram or Twitter so I can reach you and make sure to be a subscriber. Don't forget to like this video for more support. Until then, I'm sending love. Bye.